I see you there. Welcome to Living Elite. I've been reading a lot about charcuterie. Say it with me. Charcuterie. Cheese. Say it with me. Porch. Cheese. Rolls off the tongue. Speaking of which. Gastronomy. Oh, CC. Wee wee. Finest wine. Ooh. From the freshest bag. CC wee wee. <laughs> so today in Living Elite, we will show you how to say it with me. Charcuterie. Obviously, any, the best part of any good charcuterie board is the, the cheese. Mm. You gotta have cheese. So here's a cheese. That's the heart and soul. The heart and soul? It is. I mean, I guess charcuterie doesn't have to have cheese, I don't think, actually. A cheese board has to have cheese. For sure. Yeah, but a charcuterie is more Could like be a, a, a meat, like a meat plate, right? I don't know. I don't know either. What do we know? We just telling you what we know. Here's cheese. <laughs> I like cheese. <laughs> so you gotta get some fancy cheeses. What kind of cheese is this, man? It's a uh, buffalo hot sauce. <laughs> yeah. Cheese. Buffalo hot sauce cheese. Yeah. So yeah, we're, uh, this is bringing it down. Well, this is our white trash <laughs> cheese that we brought to the fancy table here. Mm -hmm. um, you can do like a fancy uh, blue cheese. You can do uh, lots of bread. I like it with crackers. You like crackers I better? Do. See, I actually like the bread I don't better. say I like it better, I just like crackers. So, so. you don't like bread? <laughs> no, I like a mixture. Oh, you like both. Bread and cracker. All right. So yeah, you get your cheeses, you get your bread, you can do crackers, and then you start arranging it on the plate. Um, so what we're gonna do for you guys is we're gonna have a little competition. Ryan versus Billy. Wow. He's gonna make a board, and then we're gonna see who's better at the end. So that's why you can't see our arrangements right now. Mm -hmm. All right. So these are the meats. <laughs> Looks yeah. like here we got a little bit of pepperoni. What's this called? Pastrami. Pastrami. Pastrami rami. This is like uh, peppered. Pepper salami. Pepper salami. Oh, it's not pastrami. We, we made that up. It's a hot co cop of cola. Ooh. Sounds Italian. <laughs> hot cop of cola. It's delicious. So you got meat. We have the meat. So what's cool about the about these mates, you just grab them and then you just throw them out a lot. Shake them. I just that's not what I was gonna show you guys, but it's just really good. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever see those videos of the dogs trying to catch meat and they're like you completely <laughs> miss it? <laughs> or it goes it's off their face. face. Mm -hmm. I don't think I've seen that, but I probably would enjoy it. Not just funny some videos. Ooh, I love that show. Mm -hmm. So we made a list of all the top things, the bougie things that bougie people do <laughs> and say. So like, how do you even say the word boogie? Boogie. Boogie. It's, it's boogie. Boogie. Burger. Bougie. 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 Yes. Bougie. 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 First thing is, they say they went to an Ivy League school. We're just jealous. <laughs> I didn't even graduate college. I mean, you did, but. That's an Ivy League school. Yeah. Like, oh, I went to yes. Yale, third degree. I don't know what that means. Oh, I was naming off murder charges, third degree. <laughs> yeah. Wearing anything seersucker without being in St. Bart's. You know what that, what that means. <laughs> what does that even mean, bro? That's a sentence. Not watching their own kids because they're too busy trying to keep busy. <laughs> Sounds about right. <laughs> That's spot on. <laughs> uh, can you come over and watch my kids today? I have like tennis practice. <laughs> <laughs> you call a babysitter over and you have a nanny. And you're like, hey. <laughs> We just I'm need some extra hands on deck. I really need to go to the spa. <laughs> I'm kind of stressed lately and I need to get this changed. <laughs> Worked out on my back. So good. <laughs> Alright, so you got your cheese, you got your breads, you got your meats. Uh, accessories, that's the next 
the next thing. Accessories is, uh, that can go a lot of different ways. You got, you got jams. You. Yep. What is, what is that? Some kind of jam? It's a fig. Some uh, some things like that. What are you going to show? Some them? olives. Some olives. Pickles. Grapes. Grapes. Oh, double grapes. Double grapes. They're graping it. Nuts. Oh. Got some nuts. <laughs> Gotta have the salty nuts. You can have some nuts. So all these accessories, it's, I feel like the cheese board is more about the arrangement. I mean, you do have to have all the goods, but the arrangement of everything is what's For sure. It tells a lot about who you are as a person. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Talking about art galleries and original pieces. This is an original Oswald. Wow. Only made in Paris, France. I was at the Louvre and I saw this and I knew I had to have it. Would you pay for it? Like 1700 thousand million. million. <laughs> this is one for you pretending to be a real housewife. That's what you do. <laughs> what I do? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> oh, you know. Oh, yeah, I know. So we're going to do a blind taste test here, see if each of us can figure out what cheese we are going to try. Okay. Just get in here. Just get in here. Swallowing. Right? Sorry. It was a giant piece. <laughs> uh, it tasted like a spicy cheese. So it's probably our white trash cheese that we brought <laughs> to mix in with the bougie. The hot buffalo cheese? Nope. No? Mm -mm. Wow. Oh. It's a three pepper. Three pepper. That's yeah. my next guess. Mm -hmm. oh, nice, nice, nice. You failed. All right, your turn. Okay. <laughs> Close your eyes, bro. That's not the cheese I want to get. <laughs> Blue cheese. Yeah, mm. it's my favorite. Very good. You like it? Mm -hmm. You like blue cheese? Bro, oh, it's so good. It's very good. It's very strong, but it's oh, good. It's the best. I still have my eyes closed. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All right, man. You ready for the reveal? Are um, you down on yours? I'm super done I'm, and ready. I worked really hard on mine. I'm I done. So. Okay. Pretty much got you beat. I don't know. Mine so, is pretty good. I like pretty, mine. It's pretty legit. <laughs> so, right. so, yeah. So, it took me about three hours to put this together, chopping things up. And let's see, three, two, one. It's beautiful. Describe it, bro. You got the grapes from the Garden of Eden I do. here. Garden of Eden. I got some fig. I got some apricot jam. Um, I got some brie. Yeah, crackers, cheeses, yeah, nuts. Prosciutto flour. Prosciutto, salami, pastrami, shmishmami. Flour. Pickles. <laughs> I can pretty much eat this right here. This is my meal that's for beautiful. the night. That's a, good, that's a good board, man. Thank you. Way to go. So, I'd say it's probably 100 out of 100. Yeah, pretty much. I would yeah. say so. If yeah. I was a judge, I would hold a sign up that said 100. Preach. But until you saw mine, then I would change this. True. Part. All right. Yours is solid. This is really good. Yours is solid. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, so I work really hard on mine as well. I'm going to show you my reveal. And uh, yeah. I mean, I think everybody knows the winner. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so golden, luscious locks, a beautiful cucumber smile. What else is there to say? I know. It's just, <laughs> it's just it's beautiful. It's a beautiful charcuterie. It's a work of so. art. <laughs> and the winner is... <laughs> Ryan! <Yay! laughs> Billy! If you like this video, why don't you like, subscribe, uh, leave us a comment. Kind of what you like to put on your charcuterie boards. Mm. Okay? Because it doesn't have to be cheese or meat. Could be anything. Could be fruit. Could be fish. Could be your mama. I don't know. Okay. Awkward. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Thanks, guys. See ya. All right, bro. See ya.